The biggest and possibly the best stable in North American harness racing is presided over by Bill Houghton. His well-bred stock consistently ranks the stable among the sport's wealthiest. For some trainers, that would create pressure, but Houghton relishes the challenge. I really don't think of it because I'm used to it. We've been at it for so long, and uh, I, I didn't used to have many high-priced yearlings. I was always lucky with the cheap ones. But uh, you get used to it, and you don't even think about it. I train them, treat them all the same if they cost 500000 or if they cost 5000 Not only are Houghton's horses successful, but so is his family. Son Peter ranked as one of the top harness drivers before he was tragically killed in an automobile accident in 1980. Another son, Tommy, today is one of the top drivers on the Grand Circuit, as the Houghton legacy continues. Never did push the boys at all to get in. They've done it on their own, and uh, the way they've taken a hold and the way they work around the barn, not only the driving, but uh, they're very much interested in the training and the taking care of these horses to get them on the racetrack. I know Tommy said to me one time, he said, most of the races are won right in the barn, and that is true. The champions who have carried Houghton's familiar green and white silks to victory are too numerous to mention, but include four Hambletonian winners and five Little Brown Jug winners. Now in his early 60s, Houghton shows no signs of slowing down. The whole thing is I just enjoy it. I don't know what I could do if I ever quit. I don't know what I'd do because I, it, I really enjoy it. It's not really that much work to me. With nearly 5,000 career wins, Bill Houghton just keeps on rolling along. This is John Henderson reporting.